The wilderness always hides many complications, where predator and prey have a close relationship with each other. And there, death is an integral part of nature. Zebras being herbivores also cannot escape this fate. In the battle for survival in the wild, however, they are not easily defeated. In today's video, discover why zebras get injured and what's happening to them. Injured Zebra Zebras are of the species of the horse family of Africa. They have hooves that make it easier to navigate in hard, rocky terrain. This animal occurs in a variety of environments, from grasslands, savannas, woodlands and thorny bushes, to mountains and coastal hills. They usually move in groups. Zebra's favourite foods are hardy grasses and sometimes even leaves, which provide their daily nutrition. They often run in a zigzag path, making it difficult for predators to catch them. In addition, zebras are fast runners and can outrun many predators by running at speeds of up to 65 km an hour. Their speed is like that, but sometimes they can't escape the clutches of formidable predators, especially lions. With just one powerful bite, a lion can easily knock down a zebra without much effort. Lions often hunt other mammals, especially medium to large ungulates. They possess many innate characteristics such as strong physical strength, strong teeth, sharp claws and skillful hunting techniques. So most animals when targeted by lions will have good results. The unit is not successful. So if it's possible to escape this terrible predator, it's very normal for zebras to be injured. Just like this zebra was targeted by the lions, just a moment later, the lions quickly identified the target and rushed in to chase. Fortunately, the zebra escaped death, but it appeared to be seriously injured. When injured, they will have a lot of disadvantages because if they meet the next predator, they may no longer be lucky to be injured but may die from them because the injury makes them unable to run fast. On top of that, not only can they be in danger on land, but even in the water. Getting injured can kill them when encountering crocodiles. Like this zebra, licking its wounds, but unexpectedly, the swamp killer was already waiting. It quickly attacked the zebra, and they got a full meal. Crocodiles often have a large body size and live strongly in swamps and rivers. For species that live on ground or in the water, they can become food for crocodiles. Its strong tail allows it to swim very fast. Thanks to the advantage of attacking their prey underwater, when they see their prey coming to drink water at the river's edge, they look for opportunities to attack. They often hit the opponent with the death pit, which is the neck where the prey's weakest point lies. So it was not difficult when zebras were in their sights. Zebras can only endure the fate of being food for these hungry monsters. Like a unique human fingerprint, each individual zebra has its own unique black stripes. The stripes on the body are a very good camouflage weapon, because when hidden in the grass, they could confuse predators. Like most ungulates, the zebra's eyes are located on the sides of the head, giving them a much wider field of vision. In addition, the zebra's hearing is also very sharp. Their ears are round and larger than common horses 
because of the terrain where they live. Zebras often have to move to find food and water. Sometimes, this species gathers in large herds to migrate to a better habitat and avoid predators. Although zebras are known to be one of the gentlest animals, however, when competing for mates during the mating season, they change their temperament and become aggressive. They are ready to rush into each other to make a terrible war to compete for each other's mates. Casualties are inevitable. Most fights between zebras usually do not leave serious injuries to the opponent, but if unlucky, they may be attacked by the next predator. It is true that in the battle for survival in the wild animal world, painful images cannot be avoided. But we can see that despite being in a weaker position compared to the carnivores, the endurance of zebras is quite good to adapt and survive in the environment. Injured animals that will be prey for predators are a testament to the fierceness of the wild, unfair world. If they don't protect themselves from war with their fellows or their own aggression, the price to pay is their lives. In life, there are difficulties that seem insurmountable, but just try to overcome them yourself. Luck will smile at all of us. The video ends here. Thank you for watching the whole video. If you love exploring the animal world, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. And now goodbye.